were. We, we jumped on that, that pitcher early in game one, and then we kind of lulled. I wish we could have finished in five, but now finished in six. Bogart had a great at bat that last at bat to drive in the, the winning runs. And so uh, it was nice to see that. All this past week, we've been working on the down ball in and out. And when we saw those pitches, we were just going for those and attacking that pitch. Um, she threw us a couple change ups in there, and you know, we had some hit batters. It's always nice to get people on base when big hitters come up. And so I think that was our plan. Yeah, my goal is just to get ahead of batters and then just rely on my defense to make plays and do a good job, so it's good. Confidence breeds confidence. Success breeds success, and uh, I think that's exactly what we saw. And the challenge is continue to make adjustments throughout at bats throughout the game because uh, you're probably not going to get the same pitches every time you get up. If you don't, uh, if you don't make the adjustment, they're going to they're going to fool you sometimes. So we've got to continue to make adjustments as the game goes on. It's always nice to get those wins at home, especially, and so when we can get in a groove and keep winning like this, it's really nice. It's nice to be home. Uh, I'm thankful the ground crew did a great job and uh, the facility crew did a great job getting the facility ready today. Um, and Drake being an in-state rival as well as Iowa State and, and you and I, they're never easy games, and these midweeks mean a lot. Uh, so we've got to get out there and be ready to attack early um, and then stay, stay consistent in that approach throughout the game because um, Drake's a very good ball club.